Welcome, folks. This is Tom O'Brien of TFNN. We go five days a week. We go seven hours a day. We go 24 hours a day in the Internet at TFNN.com. Always remember, folks, whatever you think about, you bring about. Whatever you focus on grows. Hope everyone's having a great day, safe day. Let's make it a great night, folks. Be impeccable with your word. Replace fear with love. The human mind is like a fertile ground where seeds are continually being planted. When you're impeccable with your word, your mind is no longer a fertile ground for the words that come from fear. Your mind is only a fertile for the words that come from love. Market-wise, let's take a look at it out here. We have the Dow Industrials up 401, Nasdaq's up 158, S&P's up 49, gold contract down 550, trading at 1987 an ounce. We have silver up seven cents, $23.96 an ounce. Light sweet crude up a buck ninety-six, seventy-two dollars eighty-two cents a barrel. Notes and bonds. A ten-year note down eleven ticks, trading one fourteen eighteen. The thirty-year down ten at one twenty-eight twenty-six. And king dollar. King dollar is up two hundred ninety-eight ticks, trading one hundred two eight sixty-two. The euro is at one hundred eight. The yen's at one thirty-seven. The British pound is at one twenty-four to one U.S. dollar. Our phone number is eight seven seven. Nine two seven six six four eight. Give us a call, folks. Want to know what's going on in your world and the world of the S and P's? Let's take a look at them. Well, first, I'm going to do the daily first because what is happening out here is that we're getting volume in the spy. So, if you take a look at this, you get an expansion of volume. That little swing point up there, you know, that is laying out that 417 only has 62 million. Well, we're already done 62 million. Your other swing uh, does have the 100 million, but I suspect that's what it's trying to get into right now. So the number you really want to watch real closely out here today is going to be, let's see, that's yeah, 415.26. And what that is, is that that's the low of the high. Because what we have done is this, that the high of that spike is 417.62. Now, if this is going to go after it, it should be able to close into that bar, which is the 415.26 particularly because you have an expansion of volume, okay? So, now that's, that's how it's set up on the daily right now. But keep your num that, that number. Yeah, let me write this number down, actually. 417, 415, 26, yeah. 415, 26. Okay, so now we go into the E-minis. You get a different story here in the e minis. Not, 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 yeah, you, you do have a different story because what you have is this, is that you don't have any juice up here at the top. Doesn't mean you won't get it, you know, because this bar here. Now, see, this will get interesting right here because see this bar here, the bar that we're just coming. You can see up the highs, you didn't have any juice. It, it come down. But we didn't have is a high volume bar on the way down also. And when you look at this, it's like, OK, kind of right there is the last place that we had volume. And the high of that on the way up today, because it's been trending higher all day, is uh, 41.63 and 41.55 at the bottom. So what we just did here, you got the expansion of volume on this bar, so this next bar is going to be crucial. That's the real bottom line, because we'll see if you can get a follow through at a bar, then you're going to get up to those highs. We go into the NQs. The NQs are set up differently, no doubt about that. The, the way the NQs are set up, they, they have strength. The NQs, even when you take a look at this, you're going to see the differences. You know, we had volume all the way up to where it just come back from. See this? That's that bar there. That is uh, 633, and we just got down to 619, and it rejected it. So we'll see how that one shakes out. We go to the gold contract. We take a look at uh, GC. We take a look at the gold contract out here. Gold contracts down 540. You got almost 100. Well, you do have 195,000 contracts traded, and this baby is trading at 1987, and the bottom of this consolidation is 1980. So this is getting dangerous. You know that's the bottom line inside the gold market. They, they want to crack. We go to the note and bond market. Note and bonds they still want higher price. You're going to see them. We're pulling back here. You only got 1.2 million contracts inside of the 10-year. That's not a lot of contract volume. You go on to the bottom of the consolidation. We take a look at this. And that bottom of the consolidation has monster volume. It's, we're coming into 2 million contracts. You're coming, well, way over here is even heavier, 4 million contracts. So that's still saying that wants higher price. And then 
we go right into this U.S. dollar index. And the dollar index, bottom line, you know, it has been looking for higher price. It's basically getting higher price. We'll see how this shakes out. Um, you know, it's, it's launched, that's for sure. You know, the first swing point up here is 105.853. And intraday, it's been can kind of hanging tough. We just gave up a few points, a few ticks. Yeah, you can just see, you just, yeah, in this, this morning, as it went higher, and you can see, you know, you, you, when we get up that 103, that was 103, 114, the high today. So when you take a look at that, you're 400 ticks off of that level. The real question is, is going to be like, which way does that dollar go as the next 60, 60 minutes as we come into this market? Some of the high volume equities out here today, Tesla's moving, that's up seven and a half dollars. You get advanced micro up two and a half dollars. Amazon's up by two and a half bucks. Let's go look at Amazon. That must be up at the top of that swing point right now. Yep, there's the swing. Top of that swing is uh, 114. You're at 115. Let's take a look. Put that on a weekly for a second. Yeah. It's going to be over it on the weekly, but you have a, the other contraction there, but bottom line is it's over it. Some of the other higher volume equities out here today. And we'll see what, it looks like we're gonna have some volume in the market today. Uh, Nvidia, it's nonstop, man. It's up $9, that's over 300 bucks right now. You have, uh, let's see, Intel's up 25 cents. We got uh, Wells Fargo up 213. Let's see, let's go look at JP Morgan, see if these banks they have any we know they get price under them. Let's see if they get any juice, any, any volume underneath them. No, you don't. So they're still in the consolidation. JP Morgan is up 395, but you can see the volume's dying on the vine. You come down with 12 million, you go up with 7 million. You get down with 14 million, you get down with uh, 27 million. Yeah, there's not, there's not much there. Our phone number is 877 927 6648. We have the Dow. Dow Industrials. Let's go inside the Dow Industrials actually to see the strength versus the weakness inside the Dow out here today. Point-wise, what you have, you have uh, Home Depot, uh, that's pretty wild. They, they came out with numbers, they traded it down, now it's uh, up and above. But if they're putting 59 positive points in the Goldman's putting 56, you got Boeing putting 43, uh, United Health 33, taken away from it. Amgen, minus 23, Merck, minus 11. That's about it. Stay right there, folks. We'll come right back.